Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Greg Michalowski. This is a Forex quick look at the dollar versus Swiss franc. We are seeing the dollar versus Swiss move uh, sharply to the upside in trading here today. The uh, price uh, move has uh, taken the price back above the 200 and 100 hour moving averages. Those are the green and blue lines in this chart. Uh, the 200 hour moving average comes in at 0 0.99788. 100 hour moving average comes in at 0 0.9990. The price is also moving through a swing area right through here uh, between the 1.0020 and 1.00275. Uh, we have a, a swing high through here. We have a swing uh, low through here, swing high through here, swing low here, swing low here, swing highs uh, through here. And uh, in trading here today, the price moved above that area and has come down, corrected down toward the low end of that swing area at 1.00203 and is finding support buyers against that level. The question now comes is can the price stay above that level, stay above this uh, swing area? If the price can, it has a potential to continue its move to the upside. Now, having said that, we moved above it on here, we moved above it here and tried to stay above it through here on Monday's trade but uh, reversed and moved to the downside. So there is some history of failing uh, on the moves above those levels. So uh, traders have to be aware, but this is the risk defining level. As long as the price remains above the 1.0020, the buyers remain more in control. Now on the top side, you can see that the price stalled near the 1.0049 level. What is the significance of that? And if I go to the, uh, the uh, daily chart here, of the uh, dollar versus a uh, Swiss franc. And I look at these highs going back to the month of May and June. Uh, the uh, high price uh, right here came in at 1.00637. The high price right here came in at 1.00493. And as mentioned, the high price today has approached up to that 49 level uh, currently, or the high price uh, currently reached to 1.0047. So this area right through here represents a key area to start to get to and through if the buyers are to remain in control. So although we have have um, uh, a go ahead uh, from the hourly chart uh, above the uh, above this uh, par 20 level, we also have resistance uh, near the one par 49 level on the top side that we need to get to and through. So there's a battle going on and you can see it evident uh, within these hourly bars over the last five or six trading hours where the price has ping pong between the upper extreme and the lower support level right through here as traders try to figure out which way it's going to go next. So that's the story in the dollar versus Swiss. Buyers remain in control. Buyers remain in control above the 1.0020 level. Buyers need to get above the 1.0049 level. If it's able to get above those levels, then we're going to go toward the highs that we saw in last week's trading at 65 and 73 on the top side. My name is Greg Michalowski. Good fortune with your trading. Bye-bye now.